Yo, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, ladies and gents, I'm back again with another video for you guys. This one here, it's on the Rock Aware 99, it's been in heavy rotation this summer and spring. Alright, now this one here, it's kind of like a strong, kind of muscular like, muscular -like scent. It's kind of macho vibe. It's kind of like a macho vibe with this scent as well. Uh, if you like like those strong macho type scents, this is one. This is one right here. Uh, this one got a pretty cool looking bottle. As you can see, made out of like a steel flask. This is steel. Check out the spray on it. Puts out a lot. I think this, what it said, this is a 3.4. Now, I got to re-up on some of the newer colognes that's out there. Um, so, a lot of them came out. Like I said, guys, I also wear the oils, too. The body oils. So, that's why I don't buy all colognes. I buy oils. I buy body sprays. But, see, I wear a little bit of it all. So, time to time, you'll see me reviewing the oils. Because I love oils as well. To me, oils carry on even better, in my opinion. So, uh, yeah, oils last longer. Oils get better projection, and that's just the way it is. All right, I'm kind of working up a sweat, as you can see, because I'm kind of high. I've been doing a little exercising, so I just want to bring y'all a little reviews here. And this one here is a really good one. It's like, like a kind of macho-type scent with this one. This is one. The projection of this one is B starting off. The longevity, I would get this one about, i said about six to eight hours on me. Six to eight. Um, uh, the silage. Silage on this one pretty good. You can get a nice little scent trail. You know, if you walk off from somewhere, you're definitely going to get noticed. If you can leave this spot, and go to another part of the house. Somebody else want to come behind you. They'll still smell this scent. So this cologne is pretty strong in silage, in my opinion. In my opinion, this is the one of the best ones from Rockaware. I actually like this one better than I like Rockaware Evolution. You know, um, to me, this one the better one. Uh, they got another one, Rockaware, something else. I think I have it somewhere around here. But uh, to me, this is the best one. They got Rockaware 9, I think. Uh, Rockaware. Rockaware 7. Anyway, I have it somewhere around here. I got a lot of colognes, though, scrolled around here and there, you know. So, yeah, sometimes I forget all about some of them, you know. <laughs> um, you know, I'm just dragging them out now because I've just been putting them in heavy rotation, trying to um, rock them during the spring and the summer and just. Trying to see what's up with them, you know. So they smell really good, this one. Like I said, this one here can give you more like a macho. Ah, now smelling it, it's got like a macho vibe. At the same time, it's kind of leatherish. It's got like a leatherish vibe with this one. So if you like to smell like in between like a kind of macho scent mixed in with like a leathery, it's kind of leatherish like smell. That's what this is. It's kind of leatherish too, like a. It's kind of mixed in with a, with a macho vibe. Then you spread like a leather jacket, with the macho scent sprayed on a leather coat, and that's what you get. It's like a leatherish scent mixed in with like a macho vibe. That's why I like this cologne so good. It's like a tough guy type scent. In my opinion, it's a tough guy type scent right here. Yep. And as it sits on the skin for a while, you get a lot of that leathery smell coming through. It's just like a somebody sprayed some cologne on top of a leather jacket. Y'all seen, well, I know some of you guys probably seen, I had a lot of them. Ain't you seen a lot of leather jackets? Some of the leather jackets that you buy and they give off a lot of that leather smell be real strong on them. I had several leather jackets that were like that. And I mean, you can take that leather jacket and you can pull it off. 
you can let's say lay it on the couch or something like that, or whatever, and you can smell that leather jacket all over the house, nobody. You know where that leather smell from? It? That's what this smell like. A leather jacket mixed with some kind of macho cologne. Smell like Aqua D Joe a little bit. Uh, basically smell sort of like Aqua D Joe sprayed on top of a leather jacket. Uh, that's the best way I can put it. So if you guys like Aqua Dijo, take Aqua Dijo and spray it on top of a strong leather jacket. You know, a leather jacket that give out a lot of leather smell. Spray Aqua Dijo on top of it and uh, mix it in with the leather scent. And this is what you get is this. It's got like a strong leathery type scent with it too. That's what I get. I smell leather. A lot of leather in this one. All right. I had leather jackets that smelled almost like this. So, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. It's been in my heavy rotation. This summer, I've been just rocking it. I like that leathery smell, that macho smell that it gives out. It's kind of like a tough guy scent. Anyway, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Share my videos with your family and friends. And until next time, man, y'all stay smelling good for the latest. And I'll hit y'all on the next video. I'm out. Peace.